Hi guys, thank you again for stopping by my channel. This is Simpy Kiwi. I am doing some freehand nail art today and I wanted to show you this cute floral manicure that I did. Isn't that cute? So let me show you the items that I'm using today. I am using a sinful color polish. It is called Mercury Rising. Pretty, pretty brown color. The next is going to be a glitter polish. This is Vernai Classics by Cheryl Moya. And it is called Babies in Toyland. Isn't that a gorgeous glittery polish? Isn't that gorgeous? I'm also going to be using Wet n Wild Clear Top Coat. And also to seal it off and to do it quick to, to it to do seal it off with a quick dry top coat, it will be sesh feet. And let me show you also, I've also using the Apple Barrel White Acrylic Paint. And also Apple Berry Apple Barrel. Y'all, I can get my words out today. Uh, Apple Barrel, <laughs> and this is also acrylic paint. It's called Kelly Green. I'm also using some items. Uh, these little flowers here, if you can see those here. I'm putting those in the middle of the petals that I draw. And then I'm using some Swarovski crystals here on some of the nails, which is going to be my ring and index finger. And you know I have to give it a little bling. So let me show you what I've done. Um, I've done two coats of the Sinful Colors Mercury Rising. Then I did a clear top coat and also sealed it off with sesh feet so that I can draw with my acrylic paint. If I make any errors, I can always wipe it off with water to get that off. And I'm also using, actually, I'm not going to use a brush this time. I'm using a dotting tool. And with the glitter polish on my index and ring finger, I just did a side French manicure with that on those nails. So let me show you. I've already got my palette ready here with my paints, as you can see. And let me just put it over to the side and then I'm going to uh, show you what I'm going to do with the um, with the paints. I've got a little bit of water over to the side. You probably can't see it's out of frame. And I'm going to dip it in the white just a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and push that to the side. And I'm going to position... Since I've got this one towards the tip of the nail, I'm going to push it up, go up towards this, up to the, to the cuticle area. And I'm going to do a five petal. I'm just going to get a little bit more white. And just press, just gently. Make sure I angle it. And then I'm going to wipe that off a little bit so I can drag my petals in just a little bit. And it doesn't look much like anything right now. I'm going to go ahead and clean that up a little bit, fix that little bit, that petal here. Get a little bit more white. And this one, make it a bit more rounded. The middle, it doesn't matter to me. Just want to make sure that my petals are right on the ends because I'm going to put those little flowers in the center. Okay, I'm going to let that dry. 
So let me go ahead and go to the to the to the pinky finger. And I'm going to do a small petal here, flower here. This one's going to be about four petals. And then I'm not going to too much dry that. I'm not drag that in. I'm going to leave that like it is. And then I'm going to go ahead and get my green. So I can draw my stems. And I am going to come in this, dire this direction here and just lightly drag it around like so and then I'm gonna slightly do my petals like my little leaves and there you go I'm not gonna do too much on this particular nail since my nail is not that not very long so I'm gonna go ahead and just do fix this on this end and then I'm going to do some little dots, like right in here, just some little small dots in here. Okay. And now I'm going to go ahead and put a clear top coat on those nails with the Wet n Wild. just lightly drying. I'm going to go ahead and put just a little bit of the clear top coat in the center of that flower. And I'm going to go ahead and get the little small little petal flowers I'm going to put in the center. pick one up and I'm going to place it right here in the center all right then I'm going to go ahead and get to my crystals and just make sure I put a little bit here and here so that's where I want to place them get a little of that clear top coat and get a crystal here if I can turn it around trying to get at least three on there all right like so and now let's see if this is dry enough for me to place the um, clear top coat, so I'm gonna do it generously, so I won't smear it. Okay, and now I'm gonna go ahead and get the other little petal flower and place it in the center. like so and isn't that very cute you guys I um, said I needed to do a little bit more freehand art 
and I want to let you all see what I've done to create this manicure I am going to go ahead and seal it off with sesh feet but let me know what you think of this manicure I really do think it turned out well thank you so much again for stopping by my channel you guys be blessed